Weird places where bodies have been found. Number 9. Behind a grocery store cooler. In 2019, when workers moved some coolers away from the wall of a supermarket, they found the body of Larry Ely Murillo Moncada. He had gone missing nearly 10 years earlier. It was suspected that he had climbed atop the coolers and fallen into the 18-inch space between the coolers and the wall. Authorities believed the loud thrum of the coolers blocked out any shouts for help. Number 8. In May 2021, a father and son detected a strange stench coming from a massive papier-mâché sculpture of a stegosaurus in a suburb of Barcelona. They called the police, who, with the help of firefighters, discovered a body wedged inside the dinosaur's leg. Authorities believe the victim had dropped his cell phone into the structure and gotten stuck while trying to fish it out. Number 7. In a Murphy bed. When British sisters Mildred Bowman and Alice Wardle failed to return from their vacation to Spain, in 2005, a friend alerted the authorities. Resort employees discovered both bodies trapped between their Murphy bed and its frame, which had detached from the wall and fallen on the bed, suffocating its occupants. Number 6. Disneyland Paris's Phantom Manor, filled with fake cobwebs and campy specters, turned seriously macabre in 2016, when employees discovered the body of their co-worker, a 45-year-old technician believed to have been electrocuted while fixing a broken light. It wasn't the only recent death at Disneyland Paris, five years earlier, another employee had died after getting stuck under a boat on the It's a Small World ride. It had suddenly started operating while he was tinkering with it. Number 5. In September 2006, a mummified body was located on the fifth floor of a Los Angeles building where CSI, New York was shooting a season 3 episode. The plot didn't involve a mummified body, but there was one in an earlier episode that hadn't yet aired. While some people suspected the grisly discovery was a publicity stunt, nicknamed Corpse Gate. Apparently the man had failed to pay rent, and his body was found when a building employee went to investigate. Number 4. In January 2015, a person was on a walk at the Squirrelwood Scout campsite in Doncaster in the United Kingdom, when he came upon legs and a torso sticking out of a rabbit hole. They belonged to 50-year-old Stephen Winfrey, a lifelong rabbit hunter who had suffocated to death after getting stuck in the hole the previous day. His dog, tied to a tree near the hole, was still alive. Number 3. It's believed that, after locking up Las Vegas Spa Rejuvenis one night in October 2015, 24-year-old employee decided to use the cryotherapy chamber. When her body was found the next day, it was frozen. But the coroner later ruled that her cause of death had actually been asphyxia due to an oxygen-poor environment. The nitrogen pumped into cryotherapy chambers to keep them well below freezing also diminishes the oxygen level, which can render you unconscious and eventually dead. Number 2. In the early summer of 2018, Devon Egg called his brother Brian and got his answering machine, the message said Brian was on vacation. Not only did Brian never use his answering machine, but Devon believed the voice on the message was someone else's. Neighbors had begun to report Brian as missing by late July, and the police visited his San Francisco home three times, but left when nobody answered their knocks. Other people were seen coming and going from the house, and in mid-August, a crime scene cleanup van appeared. Again neighbors called the police, who eventually discovered a room whose door was hidden behind a picture. In the room was a fish tank, where they found Brian's body, minus head and hands. Though two suspects living in the house at the time were arrested, they were later released pending further investigation. Number 1. In May 2019, while laid up at South Africa's Mahatma Gandhi Memorial Hospital with a broken femur, Sandile Sabia went missing. An internal search turned up nothing, so the staff reported his disappearance to the police. But soon, an unbearable stench intensified at the hospital, a health official explained. Eventually, it led to the storeroom, where fluid dripping from the ceiling provided the telltale signs that something was amiss. Sabia's body was found in the ceiling, but how he got there is still a mystery. And that wraps up this episode of Weird Places Bodies Were Found. We hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit that like button. And subscribe so you don't miss any future content. Thank you for watching.